Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sean of Third Rail Fight, and I hope you're having a beautiful day today. So this is kind of a kind of a yucky story, but I guess it has a happy ending. Happy for you and me, because the bad guy goes to jail. Colorado dentist arrested after arranging sex with mom and her eight-year-old daughter. I would so love to be a part of that. Ugh. That's that's what the dentist said. I'm not saying that because that's that's gross. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> that's gross. You know what's not gross? Liking, subscribing, and sharing this video. All of that stuff. But also, do consider joining my uh my locals, thirdrailify.locals.com, and uh, be a part of the Third Rail Society. Where there's going to be, uh, I don't know, a community and uh, exclusive live streams and, and and posts and content and and all all of that really great stuff. We're gonna we're gonna make it an absolute hoot. Also, if you follow on Rumble, it's this little this little red button there. You know the red button. She tells you to touch the button all the time. She says it's the man in the boat. It's the, and you're like I can't see the man in the boat. It's actually right here. I'm telling you. I'm pointing right at it. That's that's the one that you touch. You click that. You know what I mean? Takes you right there. So, Colorado dentist arrested after arranging sex with mom and daughter. Eight. <laughs> An eight-year-old um, saying, I would so love to be a part of that. That's it's gross. So, a Colorado dentist been arrested after he allegedly arranged to have sex with a mom. And her eight-year-old daughter, federal authorities say Dr. James Jason Atha, 50 of Broomsfield, started messaging what he believed was a single mother from Florida, who described in, uh, in, in online chat rooms how she groomed her young daughter with sex toys during playtime in October 2023. Now, this, this single mom is an undercover agent. She's not real. This daughter's not real. So obviously she wasn't really groomed because she's not real. Sex toys weren't involved because she's not real. I just want you to know that. I'm making that perfectly clear. He then replied, that's a beautiful thing. So, that's so gross. So, uh, the, the, the undercover agent is talking about how she groomed the imaginary daughter with sex toys. And then, and then he's, so he's like, that's a beautiful thing. I would so love to be a part of that. According to a federal indictment obtained by the Palm Beach Post, the two messaged back and forth for months until June 14, when uh, investigators say at them and the woman began discussing when he could visit her and the child. But he did not realize that the woman with whom he had been uh, speaking with was actually an undercover agent with the Department of Homeland Security. And thank God for that. And he was arrested by federal agents when he landed at Palm Beach International Airport on August 9th. Like, look at this guy's fucking face. This guy actually thinks like he got on a plane thinking like, oh, I'm going to put my dick in an eight-year-old. This guy's fucking sick. He's disgusting. He's disturbed. And there's a piece of forestry equipment. I think that it should have his name on it. Every time I criticize pedophiles, YouTube gets mad at me. So, you know, consider subscribing to me on, on Rumble and, uh, you know, hit up that locals. Man. You can do that. Uh, prosecutors say Atha spoke to the undercover agent multiple times over the past 10 months discussing the sexual acts he would like to perform on the non-existent child. I would love to find mother-daughter to play with, he allegedly wrote in one message. When asked by the undercover agent in another conversation whether he'd had sex with a mother and daughter duo before, Atha replied, unfortunately, no, according to the 27-page indictment. I've had so many of what I thought were opportunities only to get ghosted when it got down to it, he reportedly wrote. It's, it's fucking gross. I, I hope he's just making that up. 
The agent proceeded to ask him multiple times whether he was sure he wanted to have sex with her daughter, and each time he said he was, prosecutors argue. So I guess they're trying to uh they're trying to make it um as much as as possible not entrapment. Giving this guy multiple avenues to to leave, multiple off ramps. And every time he's like, no, I don't need an off ramp. I'm going to stay on pedophile highway. And then and then DHS was like, OK, buddy, we gave you your off ramps repeatedly and you stayed with it. Eventually, the agent and Atha agree that he would visit Palm Beach uh, from August 9th to 11th. And they discussed flights and plans for the weekend. At first. Prosecutors say Atha was hesitant and seemingly predicted his demise in a message to the undercover agent. He wrote, I am very nervous, but serious. In my head, I get there, and cops are waiting for me. <laughs> uh, which is exactly what happened. But eventually, Atha agreed to meet her at the Palm Beach airport. He even allegedly called the agent to discuss the details of the possible trip. Atha also allegedly asked the woman to dress the girl in something not at all age appropriate, suggesting she wear a halter top with short shorts, lipstick, and eyeshadow. I hope the worst of the worst is waiting for him in prison. That's fair, right? I can say that. I can say that. Uh, the undercover agent then suggested he start playing with the girl on the way home from the airport. Just one day before his arrest at the airport, Atha messaged the woman saying he had bought chocolate-flavored lubrication and condoms to use during sex with the girl and her mother, the indictment says. But when he arrived at the airport, Atha was accosted by federal agents who led him and the undercover agent away in handcuffs. The Palm Beach Post reports. Yes, because so to like if police came in and they just were like, Oh, you bad guy, you're under arrest, then he would know that like the that the the woman was like an undercover agent. So often undercover agents they also get arrested. And then, obviously, you know, as soon as they're behind closed doors or whatever, they're like unarrested. But it kind of like keeps the it kind of keeps the uh, the charade going. According to an arrest affidavit, he spontaneously asked how he could be arrested and how his conversations with a mother could be known to federal agents when the undercover agent revealed herself. Atha then reportedly waived his Miranda rights and admitted he flew to Florida to uh, watch the undercover agent engage in sex with her daughter. He also allegedly admitted that his phone contained child pornography, which is bad. Never have it. Um, which agents later confirmed. And he said uh, he did have all those conversations with the undercover agent, but denied he was going to follow through. And that they say that every single time, and it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that, oh, but I wasn't going to do it. No, we're pretty sure you were going to do it. Pretty sure. Like, you could say, oh, but I wasn't going to do it all you want, but you went out and you bought your chocolate lube and your condoms. I mean, you you thought you were going to do it enough to, to need protection. But also, who keeps CSAM material, adult content featuring children, on there? on their phone. Why does that have to be on your phone? Like, it's super illegal. I mean, never don't have it. It's bad. But why do you have it on your phone? Why do people... Why, why do you keep pornography on your phone? I don't get it. Is it like... Is it saved onto your phone? Why does it have to be saved? It's like... If you're somewhere and... And for, for whatever reason, you need to crank one out. I mean, and you have your phone. I mean, that's fine, right? I, you go to a website. You go to, like, you know, the various websites that, that you can go to. The hub. Or whatever. 
And, um, you know, do that. Don't save anything to your phone. Like, what the hell? Agents then conducted a search warrant and found evidence that he was involved in multiple incest and taboo chat rooms. Atha is now charged with attempted enticement of a minor and could face a maximum sentence of life in prison. He's scheduled to appear at a pre-trial detention in South Florida on Friday. In the meantime, a woman at Alpine Dental in Border, Boulder, Colorado, where Atha was employed, uh, says he no longer works there. So they, uh, they, they fired his ass. They want nothing to do with a kitty diddler. It is unclear. However, if he resigned or if he was fired, I, he was probably fired. Uh, his About Me section on the office's website notes he traveled every summer to North Carolina to perform free dental work for children and adults who would otherwise forgo their dental care, probably to uh, look at the children and diddle them, because that's what people like that do. So anyways, a Colorado dentist was arrested for arranging sex with a mom and daughter, eight years old. He says, I would so love to be a part of that. It's gross. It's actually freaking disgusting. Like the, the things that those undercover agents have to do and be a part of, I mean, eventually it gets to you. It can make you crazy. Anyways, thank you for watching this video. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Peace.